integral or an integrant i is equal to that. Now this one, let us note this, this is a sign of integral. It is called an integral sign or rather an integrant. Want to get an integrant to, to bring it back to the original equation? You use this integrant sign. Integral of x raised to power n with respect to x. And that's why I say dx with respect to x. Then, so, uh, then the integral of x raised to power n with respect to x is equal to x x raised to power n x raised to power n plus 1 over n plus 1. So what you're going to do here is to add 1, add n, x raised to power n plus 1 over n plus 1. So you have to add 1 to the power and then you divide by n plus 1. But you'll have to add a constant there, arbitrary constant. We are going to see in the example that I'm going to, uh, to show you. There is an arbitrary constant that you need to add. So, uh, e.g., if x, 3x squared minus 1 is a gradient function, you can see 3x minus 1, the derivative, uh, the, 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 the gradient for the, the integral is given by this. Now, what has just happened is that this is 3x squared plus, so you have to add 2 plus 1 over 2 plus 1. Uh, let me use a pen to showcase this. I just want to assume that you are a beginner. So we have to add 1 there, then you divide by 2 plus plus 1. And that is what you get, 3x squared plus 1 over 2 plus 1 minus, now this 1 is the same as 1 times x raised to power 0. And you need to note that x, x, x raised to power 0 is equal to 1. You need to note that. After noting that, then we can comfortably say, we can comfortably say, in this case here, we can comfortably say x, the integral of x is equal to x power 0 plus one integral of one is equal to x power zero plus one as shown there divided by zero plus one plus c. Now what is c? C is called is known as arbitrary arbitrary constant. Some people may call it constant of integration. It's called a Pittery constant. And now, what is the final answer? What is the final, uh, what is the destination to this particular uh, uh, problem? Uh, x, x, x cubed minus x plus c. So what is this? This is, is the integral function. It is the integral function. So this is what uh, we have integrated from here. We have been able to integrate 3x squared and then so that we are able to get this as the original function. Now, just not because later on we are going to look at definite integrals. If 
An integral is not defined within some given limit, such as we have the upper limit and the lower limit. Then it is very prudent that you add an arbitrary constant. Okay, let us now go to the next uh, the next slide.